My name is Vanessa. I am the senior manager of the digital sports marketing strategy team. My day at home starts with an espresso. 7.50, there, all the kids start ringing the doorbell and they start walking to school. Coming to work by bicycle absolutely is part of the routine. What we do in my team is that we use the contractual assets from the different sports properties and we create content. I think this is like the nature of Rakuten. You really get to be part of things down on Genba level. We pull up our sleeves and we are really there where the action is, where the value is really created for the company. You get so much access to opportunities and that's one of the most attractive points of working here. My name is Poom. I'm from Thailand. And currently, I'm the manager of Growth Hack Development Group in Rakuten Travel. I start working at Rakuten since 2015. I joined as a new grad. I enjoy taking photos because I can travel to many places. Even before I joined Rakuten, I was using Rakuten Travel for like booking the hotels, so I know that what kind of needs as a user. My name is Maddie, and I'm a UI UX engineer at Rakuten. And what we do is we have the responsibility of bringing designs to life. It's perfect for me because I want to do something that's both creative and technical. I think our field is one of the fastest moving fields of engineering. And to me, that's exciting because there's always something new to learn. コメダ洋介です。楽天野球団の社長をさせていただいてます。この会社に入ったのが2007年ですね。新卒でとある日の朝に社長から連絡があってちょっと新しいことやってみないかって言ってあもちろん何でしょう。ただ野球って正直もう
in order to be successful, there are two ways. One is to try by yourself, and another one is to learn from other people. My team members are pretty international. I really enjoy working with them because they are different kind of nature, different kind of personalities. I got a lot of support from them, and I can also learn from them at the same time. We are 12 nationalities on the team, a really international bunch, well-traveled, and I'm so happy that I'm working together with them. There's definitely cultural differences, and we should have those. Each person comes in like with a different mindset, a different experience, so it's, it's very valuable. So this is the meeting for the LGBT plus network. And basically what we do is just discuss strategies for our upcoming initiatives. We recently did a survey of employees to see what areas they think we can improve. To me, I think diversity means infinite possibility. Those differences, those unique ideas are going to make our business better as well. If we can make a place where everyone has dignity and respect, isn't that something that we should strive for, you know? おはようございます。え、シーズンっていう意味では、え、今日が最後です。まだまだ完成形じゃないけど、え、このメンバーで目指していきたい。もっともっと高みを目指していきたいと思います。え、しっかり頑張っていきましょう。よろしくお願いします。自分一人だと絶対に見れない景色を見に行くのもみんなで働くことの一つの醍醐味だと思うんですよね。My grandparents were deaf. My dad was also a career counselor for people with disabilities. They face different challenges, I think. Are they disabled or is the way that we build things disabling them? Hi everybody, welcome to today's Introduction to Accessibility training. So I've been working for a while now to put together two trainings related to web accessibility. Everyone has a, an area that they care about or an area that they have experience in, and they can share that knowledge with others. When I first joined, our communication was not this flat. The member of the team cannot talk to members of other teams directly. These days, we have very kind of open communication. I think that improves our collaboration. チームが勝った時は本当に嬉しいですよね。お客さんめちゃくちゃ喜んでくれるし、みんなが、すごい盛り上がるし、スタジアム中が笑顔の人しかいないわけですよ。めちゃくちゃ幸せじゃないですか。